Hello everyone! Welcome back to Medieval Dynasty. I've done a little bit while I was off camera. Not too much, mostly just a little bit of organizing. Took the rest of the fertilizer, or rather the manure, crafted it. Of course we are completely out of room. And that actually prompted me to do something that I briefly talked about in a different episode. I mentioned that I had no idea if there was a vendor who sold baskets, since we don't have the technology to craft them yet ourselves. And we also needed something to spend our money on. So I looked at the convenient and very wonderfully accurate QR cards on the discord turns out there is a single crafting vendor who is down in Barolo which makes sense because I think the only time I've ever gone to Barolo and paid attention I was there for chickens so we're going to make our way all the way down there and buy a few baskets so that we can keep our heavy items out in the open without it looking like a random pile of goods. <laughs> we will grab one for our stones, one for our fertilizer, and then I'm thinking if, depending on how expensive they are of course, we'll buy a few more just to have because it'll be quite a little bit before we are able to craft the big baskets ourselves. I can't think of much else we really need. Of course we might purchase one of the uh, a few more just for the tavern so that we can stop leaving our ingredients on the uh, um, I, I suppose it's a counter, <laughs> even though there's no chairs up to it. Oh, you guys are very loud today. Why is it whenever we need those, we can never find them? I suppose it would be good to kill them for their fur, but we're in a bit of a rush today. Brolo's not just down the road. Oh, and there's wolves too. Where are we? Right here? Alright, take note of that. There's wolves right here along the river. For anyone who might be searching for them. We'll walk past until they notice us. So that way we have plenty of stamina to outrun. Have you noticed me, love? No, you don't care. Well, that's good. Neither do I. And off we go. I feel like we're already halfway there. Which means we've made wonderful time. It's always so beautiful in the winter. Anyhow, you can look and see all the snow-covered trees. Winter is far more beautiful in game. Sometimes it does match this in real life, but in the city, you know, you've got cars and snow plows and everything that churns the snow and turns it gray and brown with dirt. Freshly fallen snow is always beautiful though. Hello boars. Strange that you are more aggressive than the wolves now. I suppose they've probably got small dog syndrome. They need to prove that they are uh, just as formidable. Hello, little fox. You're very beautiful. Something that... I didn't ever suggest it, but... I do believe it's been suggested before. It would be nice to see different coat colors for the animals. We could take that, but that would require walking over there. And this isn't very deep at all. I thought it would be a little bit more. Um, 
What was I saying? Yes, coat colors. For Because the horses have them, they've got the variety of small coats. So it would be nice to see the sheep and the cows and the coats and the foxes all have varying little coats. There we go. That's the crafting salesman. Or the crafter, I suppose. Whoa! Hello. I don't need chickens today. Show me your wares, please, sir. Oh yes, this is a very good salesman. I didn't even know he existed. Um, we want two wicker crates for our stones and for our manure since those are things we want to be able to grab very easily then let me see um I'd like a large one I'm not sure what for but we can't build them yet so we're going to buy two of them and if we can't place them somewhere, we will just have to, um... We'll just have to store them in our own crafting station. But I think that's all we came here for, were two wicker crates and some wicker baskets. Thank you, sir. Looks very nice out there. And now we will go all the way back home. Do we have anything to do here? Does Elwyn need anything from us? I suppose we do need to talk to Elwyn. We'll do that. While we're here. We don't come out here very often anyhow. And I do believe it's been quite a few years since we bothered to speak to Elwyn at all. We maybe should go say hello. Excuse me while I get a little bit of a drink while we're crossing the river. Much better. I wouldn't bother pausing the recording at all for that, but this microphone is very good and when I lift or place my coffee cup or anything else on my desk, it's very easy to hear and accidentally make something too loud. Come back. Oh, you're Edwin. You also have a quest for me. Is Alwyn out there, then? Hello, sir. Hello, Alwyn. He says, hi. <laughs> oh, I can see some fire in those eyes. What are you thinking about so intensively? We could build an archery target. Do you want to help? <laughs> sure, do I have a choice? I will ignore this question. I can get us a straw without any problems, but we could use some logs and a hammer to build it. You do not need to say anything else. I'll be back with the rest. All right, he wants five logs and a wooden hammer. Now, how do we make a wooden hammer again? One log and 10 sticks. Oh, goodness me. I don't suppose we can buy that from anyone in town either, can we? Well, time to gather ourselves 20 sticks while we're here. We'll need 10 for the axe, and then 10 for the hammer. And then we'll need some stones for the axe as well, but those won't be too hard to find. Got a little bit of extra. Oops. Should be able to... Yep, right here. I believe we just need two. Oops. There we go. We'll get the stone axe. And then if we're smart about this, we won't have anything left over. I accidentally have the pickaxe in my inventory still. Alright, what is this? A maple tree? Um, I think we will end up with one left over because we can either have six or four. I don't think there's any birch trees around in about... Oh, wait, we'll need six, won't we? Because the hammer... The hammer requires one. Alright, two maple trees it is, then. Yep. There we go, Rasimir. Oh, 
they dropped four, which means these probably dropped three then. For some reason, I thought that they only dropped, um, three. Three, then two, then one. Either way, I suppose we'll get what we need. Where'd the other one go? Oh, there it is. <laughs> Alright, let's make the wooden hammer now. And we will have one extra log. I'll win. I have brought the items. I have sort of destroyed the trees around Gustavia for it, but no one ever seems to mind. Here you go, what's next? I know a good place to build it. Follow me. Alright, and follow him we shall. Walks a bit slow. Uh, there's an auto walk button. Oh, even that's faster than him. Shame that. You know, I tried to steal these planks the first time that I played. I think I needed a bucket. And then, of course, after I'd figured that out, I saw this bucket here. And thought I was an absolute fool. Not only that, I don't think I could even build a bucket at the time. That was back when... I believe it used to be crafted in the smithy. Or something like that. You you needed... It was much harder to make back then, is all I truly remember. It will be perfect here. What do you think? Yes. Quite a good place. What's next? Next, I will practice shooting. If you have time, you can show me how to do it. You're definitely better at it. Alright. Now we talk to him again. Hi! Alright, my apprentice. Watch and learn. I think 20 meters from the target is enough, my master. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. Yes, that's fine. We're going to back up, but not 20. We're going to back up to 25. Do I even have my bow on me? Of course I don't. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We can't even do this quest right now. We don't have a bow. Oh goodness, Alwyn. Okay, I'll come back to this. Well, can't I use something else? I believe I can use throwing stones, but I don't think I can craft those in my inventory. I wonder if we could do it with a spear. Oh goodness, let's figure this out. <laughs> I've never thrown a spear. I don't think I could do this with a spear. Oh goodness, okay, we can do it with a wooden spear. <laughs> oh goodness, give me that back. Saved by the one extra log that we have. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> well, point is, do it from five meters back than what he says for this and the further quest in his inventory makes it much easier. And that's how it's done, Alwyn, who didn't even stay to see how we did it. If you only were as modest as you are accurate, <laughs> I can't be both. There is a lot of learning ahead of me. In some time, after I've practiced more, we will organize an archery tournament. Deal. Until next time, then. Alright. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. Wait, that man was wearing very nice clothes. Why are you wearing very nice clothes? Where can I find the special vendor? In Jezerica. Thank you, sir. And off we go. Back home. Because it is night time, I will probably pause the video while I run back so that you all aren't subjected to not being able to see much of anything while I'm there. But if I run into any points of interest, I'll unpause the video. We might find one right here, actually. Sometimes, when I'm lucky, I do find the spare shovel around with the clay. Doesn't look like it this time, though. 
So, yes, I will see you all in just a moment. I will say, it's quite a bit more nerve-wracking to run straight through a pack of wolves or a, a group of boars. What would a group of boars even be called? I might have to look that up. But it's much harder to keep calm when you realize your only weapon is a damaged wooden spear instead of your handy bow. I don't even think I have my knife on me. So, oh goodness, we'll definitely have to pick those up when we get home. You can see Lesnica right there. So we're almost home. Haven't discovered anything of interest on our way here, probably because we weren't following the path. Oh. But we'll be there in just a moment. Ah, home sweet home. Into bed we go. We'll organize our tools once we wake up. Hello, my wife. Do you have anything to say to me today? You look like you could grab a bite? I am hungry. I forgot to eat. How's our kingdom? Oh, yes. We need to repair the hunting lodge, don't we? First of all, let's put away all of this stuff that we don't need. Bring back out our things that we do, along with our hammer. Quite a few stone axes we're collecting. Alright. Now then, let's start by repairing the hunting lodge. We'll likely need some straw, and we have some sticks in our inventory. So let's grab both of those. Just a random amount, much more than we need again. Alright, very nice. Up we go. Somewhere around here. There we are. All right, repair. Got the walls and the roofs. Looks like that's everything. Oh, ran into a tree. Very nice. Excuse me. Down we go. Oh, goodness. Oh, we should eat that apple that our wife gave us. Much better. Alright. Now then. Let's see. Where to put the fertilizer? I'm thinking right here. Well, we'll be upgrading the barn soon, actually. So perhaps right here would be more fitting. Let's see. Yes, I think that's just fine. Now we definitely can't carry all of it, of course. 61, so we can carry 14 more. All right. I think we will do stacks of 100 in the wicker crate. 80, 90, 100. Alright. Just for the moment. Very nice. Out we go. And it's taken me quite a bit of practice to do things. You see, I still mess up sometimes. But this is essentially how you're going to be decorating anything. Lots of trial and error. It's not too bad. And I do believe that the developers have stated intentions for a different sort of system in the future. Which I'm very excited for. 90... 
Very nice. And this will free up quite a bit of space. It looks like we are out of time for this episode, which is fine. I'll just be doing a little bit of this decorating anyhow. But I'm going to leave this one here. We repaired our hunting lodge and managed to run all the way to Barovo and still do Alwyn's quest. I think that's absolutely wonderful that we can do it with the wooden spear, to be honest with you. I don't think any of this is going to fall into the wicker crate, we'll see. I want stacks of 200, please. Well, hold on a minute. I want... 60 kilograms worth. What is that? 121? We'll do stacks of 120. Alright. Yes, I am going to do a little bit of reorganizing with our new baskets. Put our stones in them, for one. And then I will see you guys in the next episode. For now, goodbye!